Well, there you are looking at uh, garage sales that happen throughout our community, and we will be talking about a very special one happening this weekend in the center town area. And here to tell us a bit more about it, we have Wynn Kwan, who is the organizer of this fantastic event. Uh, thanks so much for coming on the show this You're morning. Welcome. And tell us about this garage sale. It's happening in center town this very weekend. Yes, that's right. It's uh, coming uh, rain or shine, starts at 9 o'clock and ends at three. Mm -hmm. uh, the boundaries of Centertown is like uh, Wellington down to Queensway from the canal over to Bronson. Okay, and so why did you decide to organize it? Because it's the first year for it the is, event. It is the first year. The basic inspiration is the uh, Great Leap garage sale. Yeah. You're probably familiar with that. The it's big one. very successful. And uh, I've been a longtime resident of Centertown for many years. And I'm thinking, why not have something in Centertown? Right. And have something as fun and, and as cool as uh, what they have got in Glebe. So. so how can people participate in this? If you're a vendor, it's, it's, this is very grassroots, so I'm uh, thinking, you know, you just go out to put stuff out on your lawn, put stuff out in your driveway, mm -hmm. and if you're a buyer, just come around and shop, basically. Shop. Yeah. So basically yeah. check the Centertown uh, area out this weekend. Now, you're also adding some different things to the mix. You've added a charity component to this garage yes, sale as well. Yes, that's right, yes. Vendors can uh, voluntarily donate 10% of their proceeds to the Centertown Health Community Center, okay. uh, which is a... Uh, health services center that's based in uh, in the downtown area. They provide a whole gamut of health services from uh, diabetes education to visitors for seniors at home and uh, help for uh, new new immigrants and so on. So it's a whole gamut of uh, things. And why did you want to add sort of that charity aspect to the, uh, the garage oh, it, sale? It's, it's sort of like uh, this is a, a community event. So in some in some ways, it's a, it's a way for people to also support something that benefits the community as well. Okay. So, yeah. And so, what items are you looking for for people, you know, to bring out of their homes? Oh, anything that they, they want to get rid of, basically. Um, anything that they, uh, you know, rather than throwing it away, uh, you can convert it into cash. Anything that uh, they feel like selling, it's like typical garage sale type <laughs> yeah. stuff. Yes. All right. This uh, we're looking at these things, and I was trying to figure out what this is, and I still yes. don't know. I thought maybe it was like something to hold your rings on? Yeah, good guess, good guess. It's Not actually quite. a mold for a kitchen glove. Oh, so, that's an interesting, and this what, is, you had this in your home? I had this in my home for some reason, yes. <laughs> so uh, you want to get rid of it. That's exactly it. A friend of mine used to work in the factory of, uh, that used to make these things and yeah. then they decided not to make them and so now so now you have it in your home and you're getting rid of it and this is part of the weirdest things yes, that's competition right. that's that you things, have happening that's right that's an extra special thing that we have um, on our website you can see that um, you can if you buy something strange or weird send a photograph of it to us and the winner will get a box of Suzy Q donuts Oh, that's a good idea. Yes. You know, I'm already thinking uh, of revamping this. I'm a DIY person, so okay. I'm thinking, you know, you can cut it off, make a vase out of it, or you can even use it as a ring holder. I there know lots go. of girls have tons of rings in there. It would be a very unique item. Yes. Yeah, yes. it would be. I can actually see the value of this rising as we go. Oh. Yeah. What's this? That, that is, I don't know what that is, but it's something that I picked up. <laughs> it's a multicolored voodoo hammer. And with it makes a nice sort sound. of weird sound. Right. All right, we also have some tips for people as yes. well on your website. Yes. Uh, this is... Uh, the Super Center Town Garage Sale. Yeah. And one of the things I also wanted to mention too is that this is a, a new nifty thing. You can oh. actually go to this other website and plot your location on okay. the map because Center Town is a big area, so it, is. That's it right. is maybe hard for buyers to know exactly where to go. Okay. And it would be cool for them to just bring up this map and then you can see and you can kind of go in. And so is this where the people who will be having garage sales? That's right, yes. Cool. So there you go, right now. That's really interesting. So if yes. you kind of don't want to wander around, you exactly. can head there. Exactly, you can just, yes. All right, yes. we also have some tips that you have on your website as well. That's right, For yes. vendors, right? Yes, for vendors and for... So promote your own vendors. location on the Centertown website. Yes. Use hashtag SuperCentertown to tweet your location. Right, on the day of. Okay. Have lots of change on hand. Yes, people forget that, but you have right. to be able to make change in order to sell something. And yes. prices should be clearly marked. Yes. So That's these right. are just some tips for people who want to participate. That's and right. if they want to participate, you suggest them putting it on, their, on your website. Yeah, uh, this is, uh, on my website, there's a link you click on the map of vendors. And then they can plot it from there. Yes, it takes you to another Okay, website. we have a few more for uh, buyer tips. Get the yes. best picks, come early. 
to get the best prices, stay late, and carefully check over an item before you buy, and also check out the Weirdest Things contest. And of course, we can find more information at supertown.com. Uh, Supercentertown. Supercentertown.com. Yes. Well, thanks so much for being on Thank the show you. this morning. And people, bring out your weird things. Maybe someone else will come and pick this up. <laughs> yes, that's right. Thanks so much for All being right. on the show this morning.